What are we doing here, Tim? I am showing you why your flip camera should be replaced by this. I, I call this my Ferrari camera because it's red and it looks cool. <laughs> what, it's a Canon you got there? It is. It's a Canon, what is it? A Canon SD4000IS. Now, here's the reason why you need this camera. Now, wait, are you promoting for these guys? No, not really. I just like the camera. Did you buy this? I did, actually. Right. It does. It matches the watch. Oh, look at that. Okay. But the real reason is it has a slow motion camera on it. So you can take video and it plays it back like super slow motion, which is kind of the bomb. And it takes really high quality. So I like that. Well, can, what, what do you want, Puffy? You could speak. It's a, oh, but can we take a picture together? <laughs> Puffy, the video guy, would like us to take a picture together. Right. No, with your camera. Come on, turn, turn hold it on, around. Hold on, hold on. Let me figure out how to do it. And then put it in the American Idol tour book. All right, I'm down. All right, Puffy, snap away. i got to ask Tim some questions here. All right, I'm on your camera. Hey, Tim, take this in the best way. I mean this as a compliment. That is never the best. <laughs> what? How do you even start something like that? No, for real. No, wait, wait. Here, here's the deal. That's okay. as bad as someone saying, Tim, what's it like after your life got voted off American Idol? No, Somebody no, asked me that. No, no, no. This will be all right. This is a compliment, actually. On the show. Don't take this the wrong way. No. It's going to come out the wrong way, but it's good. On the show with the whole smile thing. Right? You kind of, on TV, you looked a little goofy, okay? A little bit. A little goofy. In person. Wait a minute, Tim. Hang on. I haven't finished. Hold on. <laughs> wait. <laughs> How is this a compliment? Wait, because in person, he's really a good-looking dude. Goofy on TV. In person, he's a stud. How's that? Bro, that's like that's like slapping me, then apologizing afterwards to make and being like, "Can we be friends?" Let's see. Flash him the smile, though, Tim. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. All right. It's actually it's actually funny you say that. I've heard that a couple of different times. Have you really? Well, just that on TV I look a certain way, and then in person it's it's different. And we actually, um, I had a convers conversation with somebody about this a couple like yesterday. Actually, is that on TV people kind of got this um, this image of me. They made some some um, decisions about me. Just based on this, a guy smiling on TV that they saw for about two minutes a week, you know? And they decided some things about me that aren't even necessarily true, just about like my personality and stuff like that. And so, for me, I love meeting people and getting to talk to them in person because I want them to see that I'm not just this goofy kid who likes to walk around with a big old grin on my face, you know? You got substance, man. Yeah, I, well, you know, I, I, like, I like to think that there is a little bit more to me, you know? And... What, what are you doing on stage tonight? Because you were like, out of all the people in the show, every week was like, hey, you were great. Oh, that was a little weird for me, dog. You know, like all like crazy, crazy vibes from the judges. So what did you choose to do on the tour? I decided to, instead of trying to necessarily throw some gimmicks out there or anything like that, I decided, I'm only doing two songs, right? I wanted to pick songs that I felt were good for the show. We're good for big, big arenas and big, big stadium style, and that, you know, would kind of fit with everything, and then show who I am as an artist. So the songs I picked, like, they're not the softer ones that went over better on the show, because those songs, like, you play it for in, a, in a big, uh, you know, big venue like Jones Beach, and it doesn't, it doesn't transition well. You know, through a television screen, that you, people feel like you're singing to them. But if I did, I like, can't help falling in love on this stage, the people in the back row would be like, I can't even hear what he's saying. They go get popcorn. Yeah, exactly. So, you know, I had to, I had to you know, not do some songs that went over better on the show and, you know, pick, uh, pick songs that fit the, the, uh, the venues better. Uh, you like Long Island? Too hot? Is, is this all right? The weather good for you? Well, I'm from Texas. So oh, please. I don't, I don't mind this. Um, it kind of reminds me of home. But then the flip side of that is it reminds me why I hate Texas summers. Um, <laughs> No, that's cool. I actually spent four hours walking around uh, New York City yesterday. You know, Aaron said he was shopping for cars. What's up with that? What'd you do? I got lost. <laughs> Where'd you end up? Well, no, I... Where we were saying, I decided I was going to walk all the way down to Central Park. I didn't realize how far that was until I got there. And then I decided I was going to walk through Central Park, which I've never done before. It's really big. It's pretty big. Yeah. Um, definitely got turned around a couple of times. And when I finally found my way out to the street, I figured out that I was not where I wanted to be and going the wrong direction. So that added to the four-hour walk back. Um, no, but it was good times. It really was. Hey, we see a lot of New York that I wouldn't have seen otherwise. We're happy to have you here. There's going to be a nice, cool breeze off the water tonight. Good luck to you. Thank you. Appreciate it. Appreciate it.